Hello, my name is Caitlin with Fuss Palm Dog, and today I'm here at Rocky, and we are going to be working on his downstay. Now, what we're going to be doing is setting up Rocky in a downstay, and the goal is that I want to be able to walk in front of him without him breaking position. Come on. Down. Oh, just going to wait for him. Yes. Stay. Now, the reason why I'm, rocking, I'm walking in front of Rocky is because I want to get him used to me moving around while he stays in position. This is how we start walking around a dog, which is a particularly difficult exercise. We always start in front of the dog and then we slowly make our way behind them. And today we're just showing that in front of them process. So I'm going to go ahead, treat, reiterate that stay. Stay. Uh-uh. Now right there you see popped up, I'm just going to bring him right back, come on. Put him back into position, but I'm not going to treat him. I don't want to reward that breaking. Stay. We're going to try that again. Yes. Stay. And you see I'm starting with one side, I'm just taking a couple steps away. Yes. Returning to my original position. Stay. Treating and then reiterating that stay as necessary. Yes. Stay. And you see I'm starting real slow just by dividing it up by side. Yes. Stay. One more time. Yes. Yes. Stay. Now I'm going to do is I'm going to start doing a full walking back and forth. So instead of breaking it up, I'm just going to do it in one full go. So once again, treating to reiterate that stay. Stay. Yes. Like I said, you see it's very short distance. Stay. Just because me walking around counts as a distraction, so I want to decrease the distance between us and decrease the time between treats. Yes. Stay. All right, one more time. Yes. Tap on the head to release, okay. And that was a very nice job from Rocky. As you can see, even though he broke in the very beginning, once I put him back down, he did a great job of staying in position. As I walked around, you can see we're starting very slow just by walking in front of him. The next step would be to start walking on the side of him and then finally start going behind him. But overall, really nice practice session today.